Welcome back, everyone. Now it's time again in our show to get our dorm cooking on. You know, we're going to make some peanut sauce ramen. We'll be taking the college staple dinner on the go and kicking it up a notch. That's right, y'all. We're pimping your ramen. I can't believe you just said that. I know. Why did I say that? <laughs> Anyways, it's, it's great, though. All we need, um, you need, of course, you need your classic ramen, but you also need a third cup of peanut butter. All right, why don't we add this to the peanut butter that's already okay. in the bowl, put so, a little bit yeah, more in. I just want to get that now, good money I, shot of the peanut butter I going. I love oh, peanut butter. Yeah. I think pretty much if you put peanut butter on anything, it'd be delicious. It's great. I think it's so good. Peanut butter on apples. Peanut exactly. Peanut butter on Everything. jelly. Delicious. That's, that's a classic. Right? Now we have some water in this bowl. You actually need a third cup of water mm -hmm. to add to this mixture. So we can yeah. just put it right in there. And then there's a lot of little little uh, nuances of this dish that uh, things like soy sauce. Okay, so let's put a little bit of soy sauce okay. already because we have some pre-measured out. Right. Put a little bit more in. And then you got some spices that you probably wouldn't taste uh, otherwise if you didn't know they were in there. But we got some cayenne and some garlic. So we put a dash in of each. So we put a dash in each. Perfect. Yeah, we we're going to put two tablespoons of the lemon juice in. Oh, uh, there you go. Lemon juice actually brings out a lot of flavor into different things. That's yeah, why you exactly. put lemon zest in a lot of yeah, things. Yeah, exactly. Um, okay, so we're going to mix this all together. Okay. So, Pat, I know that you are, you know, obsessed with mixing. So I really why like don't you mixing. be careful? I've just been trained really well. And carefully okay. mix this together. Okay. Now, so. the thing is with the peanut butter, you kind of just have to incorporate it very slowly because yeah, the, oh, the oh, water. Oh. Yeah, the viscosity of the peanut butter is very <laughs> intense. I, I, wrote, I, wrote, I learned that word this morning. Aren't you proud of me? Viscosity. Viscosity right, of the well. peanut butter. <laughs> While so, Pat's doing that, I'm actually going to take the ramen out of the bag okay. and we're going to want to put it in a pot of boiling water. You're also just going to want to follow the direction that's on the ramen. Mm -hmm. um, so I'm going to say right now it's good to look with your taste buds on this one. Exactly. Um, it doesn't matter what it looks like. Okay? Right. Don't judge a book by its cover. We're just going to go all. with it. We're okay? going to go with we're gonna it. Go with it. <laughs> all right. So we want to, like you and this is the key people. You don't want to put the seasoning in. That no. is probably not going to taste so good. No. So once the ramen is done, yeah. you're going to incorporate all of it. Yep. Into the bowl, you put it in here. mix it up. I promise you, the you look it, isn't yeah. that great, but it you is definitely it, yeah. delicious. And then, yeah, eventually you get what we like to call peanut sauce ramen. Look at nice that. Nice and spicy. I'm telling you, it's really strong. And if you have a roommate you don't like very much and you want to be like, look at what I'm cooking, you can make this. The whole room's going to smell like it. Everyone's going to love it. <laughs> That's wanna... a good way to spite your roommate first thing. I didn't ever spite my roommate. What? Never, never. Kisses never. poster, what? Okay. You want to try it? Yeah, let's go for All it. All right, we're um... going to take the risk. I don't know. <laughs> oh, yes. Yes. Yes, ma'am. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's a little spicy. <laughs> spicy. Paprika's a little spicy. I'm just kidding. It doesn't taste that bad, really, really, it doesn't. But as, in, as, I, as I try to swallow this, you can find all of the ingredients at Whole Foods mm. on Cambridge Street in Beacon Hill. So good. And everything is for under $20. Now, oh, Pat, yeah. you want to tell them how actually that will, you know, you'll stretch your, yeah, your I dollar. Yeah, mean, if you buy this thing for $20, look at all this sugar. It's spicy, the soy sauce, this cayenne, the garlic, it will it will work over time, you know? Twenty dollars is like twenty dishes of this thing. Exactly. And if you oh. really like spicy food and maybe <laughs> yeah. not swallowing. Right. <laughs> but now now that we're done cooking, we're gonna go check in again with our new students, Gabe and Nina, see how their moving experience went. It's delicious. If it was a little spicy. Delicious. Yeah.